What's up, Jigsaw Peace? And today, people will bring you episode number 30 of our Pokemon White Randomized Nuzzle. Before we get started, if you mind just tapping that like button down below, because your support really does mean the world. Never forget to hit that subscribe button to help me help the Jigsaw Pieces grow. That's you, beautiful people. Now, last episode, we encountered God, aka Bob, and he healed our Pokemon quite a few times. We also took on a bunch of Plasma team members. Uh, we revived the fossil. We found choice bands and choice scarves and all sorts of craziness. If you missed that episode, definitely make sure you check it out. But today, we're going to carry on through Charged Oak Cave and hopefully make it out to the other end a okay. But let's give you guys a point update to show you what we're rocking. Kicking things off, we have Raphael at level 37, Whimsicott as starter, now holding the leftovers for that reliable recovery with a moveset of Magical Leaf, Gust, Leech Seed, and Growth. Then we have Tony at level 36, Firefetch on that scope lens to get those crits with a moveset of Aerial Ace, Slash, Night Slash, and Swords Dance, although he seems to never, ever, ever, ever get crits. Then we have Joseph at level 40, Porygon 2, holding that if you like because he's a bulky, bulky duck with a moveset of Tackle, Side Beam, Signal Beam, and Discharge. Then we have Matthew at level 36, Articuno. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be a beautiful Ice Bird, holding the Icicle Plate to power up Powder Snow and Ice Shard, Ozrog and Ancient Power and Mist. Then we have Michael at level 36, Swampert, holding that Soft Sand Power up Mud Shot, Mud Bomb, also rocking Water Gun and Takedown. And last but not least, we have Vincent at level 35, Mischievous, holding the Spooky Plate to power up Hex, also rocking Side Beam, Pain, Pain Split, and Confuse Ray. So with that, we're going to go. Get, 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 get cracking. Oh, wait. I want to turn on my dowsing machine. Now, I'm pretty sure if you head the right, it triggers some sort of story, but I can't remember what. I think you battle in. I want to solve all the mysteries in the world for that purpose. I will keep fighting. I'm pretty sure you battle in, and then Bianca comes just after it. Am I remembering that right? I don't know. I don't know. It's hurting my head thinking about it. To be honest. It's hurting my head thinking about it. Die a hit? Bro. I don't even know what it does. Apparently it makes you live. But not for long. <laughs> Whether I win or lose, mystery only keep this. Alright, crazy dude. Oh, 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 oh! This is the beginning. See you in scent! Okay. Take this! The winning strategy I've developed! I'm intrigued. Sir, I am intrigued by your strategy, Kothraita Leo. Man, what's with all the mana buzzes? We can't mana buzz in the last episode. He's a, and we learnt they're quite bulky. Yeah, quite bulky. Matthew. Matthew. Coming out, bruh. Every time. You're telling me, rather than attack my grass type, you was going to flatter it? Bullshit. I call bullshit. Yeah. Oh, why is that not a two shot? You just eliminate my, oh, you lowered my evasiveness, right? Yeah, okay. I'm an eye shard. Come on, Matthew. Yes, Matthew. Matthew is not confused. He knows who he is. He knows who he is. Okay. Okay. Lily. Rock. Grass. Ah. I'm gonna go Raphael. I don't really know who to use on him. To be honest with you. But this should give. Or it might. It's going to be tight. Um, might give Raphael. Okay, that did nothing. What did he use up? 
Your special defense too. I'm gonna grow for them. Cause this might we might might be in for a long haul there. Okay. Raphael, you know you have my utmost trust. Yeah boy. Acid. I don't like that. I don't like that. Don't do that. Okay? Magical leaf, you know. Because this should be back to how he was neutral. Because he's plus two and plus two. Never mind. Never mind. My snap boosts are only hurting me more. I'm going to have to heal. Because of you. This is, Lily is starting to be a bit of a problem. Starting to be a little bit of a problem. A problem all. A problem you. Problem Problem Wait, not bad, not bad. Fine. Yeah. Magical leaf. Yeah. Come on, Raphael. And now he's ingrain. This is a problem. We haven't. All we've seen him use is acid, ingrain, amnesia. We haven't seen his fourth move yet, right? Because I feel like he has ancient power. Confuse Ray! He doesn't have it. He doesn't have ancient power. He doesn't have it, he doesn't have it, he doesn't have it, he doesn't have it. Matthew, Matthew, Matthew. Doesn't have it. I feel the pressure! It's coming down on me! Oh, 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 oh just jarred my neck! What the fuck? Oh! Holy shit, son. Wow. Oh, he's been raising his special defense. Uh, that's all, folks. He's been raising his special defense, so I should go for a physical attack. Okay. Okay. We took way too long with that, Lily. Get out of here, bro. I feel down. You put me through the fucking mincer. You should feel proud. You know what the frustrating thing is? I know what that fossil is now. And I don't care for it. So I'm not even going to bother. Here we go again. Alright. Many different values mixed together. And the world becomes grey. That is unforgivable. I will separate people and poke it all Pokemon and people. And black and white will be clearly distinct. Yo, we said the name of the games. Only then will Pokemon become perfect beings. Yes, that is my dream. That is my the dream I must fulfill. Jigsaw, do you have a dream of your own? Yes, I want to make doing YouTube my job and paying my mortgage with it so that I can enjoy my life. Thank you. And only you guys can do that for me. You have a dream. That's wonderful. I'll learn just what kind of dream you have in battle. Oh, we're battling N again. What is it this time? Is it just then? Is it just then? Or is there more to it? Sailor N! Oh, you were Sailor N last time. You have a Ditto? You lead with a Ditto? I mean, the first time we battled you, my dude, we, we you led with a Mew. You know? Like, they both can transform, I guess. Hi. He transformed into Raphael. Don't use his name. He transformed into a whimsical. He didn't transform into Raphael. Gust. <gasps> He's faster than me. Is it speed? Oh, that did a lot of damage. 
This means mine should knock him out. Yeah, yeah, we're out. There's only one Raphael. Level 38. Yaw. Get that lefty down. Lefty, lefty. Beldum. Alright. Vincent! Beldum only knows takedown. He can't touch me with takedown. Vincent's perfect. Vincent is the perfect account here. We can just straight up hex. Two shot. You can't touch me. Da 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 can't touch this. Da 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 can't touch this. What did she got? Pan sage. Matthew. Matthew. Come on out, bruh. Bruh. Show this grass monkey who's boss. Boom. Okay. Sailor N, you're going to have a good Pokemon? No, you're not. Alright, back to Vincent. Back to you, Vincent. In the studio. I will show you that my love for friends permits every cell of my body. Behold. Ooh. Bye. You lived? Yo, that shows how bulky Spoink and Grumpig is. He lived, man. I think he's gonna heal. No, he didn't heal. Okay. Okay. Bye. That was easy. My friend's getting hurt. That's what a Pokemon battle is. Well, then why did you do it? Fool. T why? Is it impossible for me to win while feeling bad about being a trainer? As if I could pursue the strength, the truth, with something as meaningless as a battle. As if that could make me worthy to become friends with the legendary Pokemon. Thanks, Paul. Oh, he berates. Uh, what's the face? Juniper. Just a little further to Miss Stroughton City. Bianca. You have good ears. I can't believe you heard Jigsaw's voice from that far away. Jigsaw, who is this trainer? Well, considering I don't speak, that is pretty impressive. <laughs> Professor Juniper, what are you thinking? You appear to have no qualms about the relationship between people and Pokemon. You put Pokemon into categories using ar arbitrary rules and think that you can understand them like that. The very idea of a Pokedex revolts me. What do you have to say for yourself? Oh my, looks like you're not my biggest fan. Your opinion is understandable, it happens to be different from mine, which is equally understandable. How about if all people get to decide for themselves how they relate to Pokemon? You're saying I should just allow people to think whatever they want and treat Pokemon and however they want, no matter whether the Pokemon suffer? I refuse to tolerate the existence of a world like that. I have no idea how that sounds, by the way. I've never listened to that back. Well, I didn't expect him to change his mind right away, but I hope he'll spend a little time trying to understand how others feel. Now then, I think I'll go collect a little more data. For Pokemon and people to get along better, we need to take steps to learn more about them. Mm, jinx all. I'm gonna go with Professor Juniper now because I'm her bodyguard. Cool, Zilla. And we're out of Charlestone Cave and in to Miss Charlton City. So let's have a quick, a quick whiz. Quick whiz here. Quick whiz. AKA, you love my Pokemon. Quick whiz. And we are exploratized the town. Thank you for waiting. I don't think the town's very big, so I think we're good. When a Pokemon learns the move Hidden Power, somehow I can tell which type of the Pokemon move will be. Should I tell what type of Hidden Power your Pokemon will learn? No. <laughs> the Entry and Pass Power. What, what in the world is Entry Link? Uh, shut up. 
Skylar's grandfather was a legendary pilot. Skylar is at City's gym right now. She has really nice pattern. That's fine. Whoa, four people. Hello. Our family is very fussy about Pokemon moves. Everybody calls me the reminder girl. I know every move that Pokemon learn while they're leveling up. Ooh. Uh, who was I again? He's the move deleter. Okay. And you are... No one. You're a nobody. Okay. I think you mean Juniper Dad? Yep. 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 Okay. Hey, <laughs> Jigsaw, right? Let me show you a Pokedex for a moment. What do we have here? So, you found 306 Pokemon, eh? Staggering! You've seen a clank? You're becoming quite the trainer. Excuse me, I was a little excited and forgot my manners. My name is Juniper 2, Cedric Juniper. <laughs> the professor who gave you my Pokedex, the Pokedex, is my daughter. That girl has told me a lot about you. It really makes my day to meet you. In order to have a meeting, I'm going to upgrade your Pokedex. Some Pokemon can change forms, even when it's the same individual. If you have already seen a form, you can check it with this whenever you want. I've also added a function to make searching easier. Okay, Skylar. Uh, do I do the typical Starbucks girl, or do we try and mix it up a bit? Hmm. Um, Sir, who's that trainer? Wow, I sound like uh, Iris. Bloody hell, that was pretty good. Oh, I forgot my introduction. Skylar, this is my friend and my daughter. Jigsaw is traveling around the universe to complete the Pokedex. Oh, I see. So that means you'll be challenging the gym. Oh boy, I'm really looking forward to it. That's right, Jigsaw. You should challenge this gym. If nothing else, this gym is really out there. See you, Skylar. If something comes up again, I'll let you know. Professor, my plane is a cargo plane. It carries cargo, not people. And you're talking as if places like Kento and Sinnoh are right around the corner. Ah, oh, Skylar. If you keep frowning, your face might freeze like that, and it'd be a shame. People and Pokemon, we all have to help each other out. See you later. Sheesh. It's hard to believe a happy-go-lucky guy like that could be a world-renowned Pokemon professor. Heads up, Jigsaw. As a gym leader, I'll be happy to have a, you challenge the gym, but there's something I need to take care of first. Just now, as I was flying the cargo plane, I saw something on top of the Celestial Tower. I'm sure that it's a sick Pokemon. If it is, I can't just leave it there. I have to look into it right away. I'm leaving for Route 7 Celestial Tower. You can come if you want, along if you want. Okay. Okay. So we don't get to do 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 get out in the gym 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 yet. If you have a gym badge from Australia, I'll tell you something cool. Cannons, cannons, Scarlet Gym is full of cannons. Oh, you get shot at the cannon. I remember. I remember. I heard many people have their Pokemon stolen by Team Plasma. Is, is that it? That, that's your contribution to this game? Oh, there's a lot of people in here. My dream has become far, far, far away. I still have that dream in my heart. Sweet, lovely, sweet heart. Check feelings between two people. If you're a great match, you can get a sweet heart. Meet sweet heart. Meet a sweet heart. Oh my god, shut up. Because I know a lot of my planes, I can maintain them. Because I know a lot of my Pokemon, I can be strong. Welcome to the city sky, Mr. Stroll, and take this as a keepsake. Shot beak. Ooh. Not bad. If it holds blah, 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 blah. We know what it does. Hey, hey, hey. Oh my god. When you use Pokemon Fly, you can use. For the places I cannot reach, I ask flying the psychic type sometimes help. I cannot imagine life without Pokemon. Hello, we'll deliver a cargo. Oh, okay. So, so you got for me? Because this control tower planes can fly safely to the sky where there are no roads. From that, I take this lesson. If trainers lead Pokemon correctly, Pokemon will feel safe and fight well. There was nothing in there for me. I want to point that out. The only planes that fly out of Mistral Airport are cargo planes. If trainers want to fly, you can 
go with a Pokemon that knows a move. Fly! We got Grass Pledge. Okay. Planes, their shapes, they're perfectly designed to fly. There's no excuses in the mechanics for flying. Uh, oh, oh, I knew there was a hidden item over here. Hey, oh. Ha, ha, I can't. Oh, okay. A paralyzed heal. And there's another one, there's another one, there's another one. Ooh, Everstone. I thought it was a. Uh, Another Eevee alive for a second. I was going to give it to. Is it the other side? Oh no, it's underneath me. A full hill. Okay. And that's it. Okay. If you want delicious vegetables, the ones will grow the best. As the weather and the seasons change, wild vegetables get more and more tasty. Even Pokemon like to eat wild vegetables. Oh, my shoulder clicked. Check that out. It's dangerous to play in the landing strip, but you, you should be okay on ours. We have a, only have one cargo flight a day. Pokemon and people working together to open up a desolate land and make a place where everyone can live. I'm certain that this cooperative spirit will remain unchanged. And that's the gym, which we can't get into yet. Alrighty then. Looks like we'll be getting a new encounter today. That's pretty cool. So let me just swap in the seventh member of our team. Real quick leak. Real quick leak. So was Vincent. I feel sorry for Vincent. Uh, let's just. Sometimes this doesn't work out, but sometimes it does. So let's see, let's see what we can get. This is Route Seven. Route Seven. Survey says. Okay. I mean, Wolverine's pretty fat. Okay. Uh, do you think he can live a wake up slap? I think so. He's pretty fair. We just said this. He is pretty fair. I know it's super effective, but yeah. Ice ball built in power. Put him asleep now. Put him asleep now. Cherry? You come through, Cherry. Only problem is I can't wake up slap him now. Oh, he looks so sad while asleep. Why? What the hell? Why do you look so sad? Oh, my heart! Nope. Stop this shit. Yo, get infatuated. Cherry this used to be the slut of the team. It's not calling it the slut of the team since she's no longer regularly working. <laughs> oh, we missed. Please be infatuated. Oh, oh, it missed. Oh, beautiful. Put him to sleep. Beautiful. That's beautiful, that is. That's beautiful. Okay, with him asleep. We can go ahead. I think Great Ball will be fine. We'll be sufficient enough. Yaw! Yaw! Lovely jubbly! Okay, Cilio, the ball roll Pokemon. It habitually spins things on its nose. By doing so, it learns textures and odors. Give a nickname? Yes. Your name is. Owen. Sweet. Um, I'm not sure if you get an encounter in Celestial Tower. I think you do. But at the same time, I don't want to drag 
cherry all the way up to Celestial Tower. So we're going to kind of win the um, the next encounter. Going to kind of wing it. But he has Encore, Ice Ball, Body Slam, and Aurora Beam. Sassy. Yo, you're a sassy kind of guy. Special defense up. Sweet damn. That's not bad. I mean, it's pretty damn good. Okay. Oh, wait. I forgot why I was... Oh, I forgot why I was here. It was to get Vincent back. Okay, or just put him at the bottom of the box, you know. That's the thing, too. God damn it. Right. Oh, hang on. I'm going to put Raphael at the front. Nope, not you. But I want a full squad of 40. I think for the next gym. But let's see how far we can get through the right now. Um, I, I kind of want to battle all of the trainers, so I'm gonna go. I'll take uh, the high road first. Oh, bold enough to come talk to me, are you? You're quite the trainer. I like you. Take this TM. Oh, oh, quiver dance. Hello, that's pretty fucking good. Yo, yo, can you imagine if Arcuno can learn Quiver Dance because of the TMs uh, being randomized? Where is this Quiver Dance? Please say Arcuno can learn it. Damn it! Damn it! Ah, <laughs> oh, man, that would have been so good. It's been so broken, but it's been so good. I wanted to go to the Celestial Tower, but I got lost and stranded. Sucks to be you, bro. Oh, Ace Trainer Bubble, we met God. He has her ho oh! Hello, oh! Raphael, get the fuck out of dirt, no! Oh my, who the hell do I go back to? Um. Michael? Yee. This is a problem. Friggin' ho ho! If he had sacred fire, oh my god! It's gonna hurt! Oh my god, he's setting up the sun! Oh my. Um. Oh dear. I'm scared. So now, basically, war gun's neutral. Well then, fuck it. Hit the hit the bomb. We haven't hit take down yet. Oh, you have gust, really? I was expecting sacred fire. Oh, no, wow. We have gust. Look at that damage. And again. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. Miss. Please don't knock me out. Ah! Oh! 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 Okay. Woo! That was scary. That was that was too scary. That uh, that that I I just nugget in my pants. I need to go clean that up. So we're gonna go ahead and wrap up today's episode here. In the next episode, we're gonna go ahead and make our way through Route 7, hopefully get to Celestial's Tower, and do Celestial Tower. That's my plan. Hopefully we don't get too sidetracked. Hopefully we don't get too delayed for whatever reason. And then head to the gym. So if you guys have enjoyed today, 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 today's episode where we got a new encounter, we took on a ho -oh, and we met the... We battled in. We met Press Juniper's dad, Cedric. We met Sky. Like, yo, we did a lot more than I even realised. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, please go ahead and like, comment, share, and subscribe. Help me in helping the Jigsaw pieces grow. I've been Jamie Jigsaw, and I'll see you guys next time.